Hey guys, in today's video, I'm just going to show you my um, MOT setup for passing emissions. And so, yeah, just got an MOT after being off the road for about two years. I've had the car a year, but it passed emissions, no problem. That's what I scored, and that's the max on the CO. And the HC is, I scored 84, max is 200. And CO for the natural idle, I scored 0 0.19, passes 0 0.30, so passed the mission's real easy. So I'm going to show you my setup. So that's the V-band cat setup. This V-band's in, no problem. there and there and then you remove it when you don't need it and this is the breather setup just basically vent both of these two atmosphere or to a catch can obviously you run a nice non-restrictive air, air filter so if you're running a PCV valve Unplug that, block it, put on some hose to a catch can. And if you're running the cross the cross flow breather system and you're struggling to pass CO2, get rid of that as well. You don't basically you don't want to contaminate the intake charge at all. You want that just to be on its own. You just need a couple of these, two V-band clamps, and you get a universal cat. I got one from the bay for a uh, hundred quid and just yeah v-band it in and run the run the breather system the way i do and you should pass emissions no problem so yeah it's pretty much that's it short and sweet and if you remove the cat after you've done uh, your emissions test then obviously it's going to last a heck of a long time because you're not you're only using it when you need it yeah so it's a it's just a, it's a sweet little setup. Unless you know the MOT tester, obviously, then you can, you know, one of your mates can do it. That's different, but I don't know anyone here, so it, it works well anyway. Like I showed you, pass, no problem, easy as. Cool. Thanks for watching.